Absolutely ridiculous. What's good, everybody? I'm gonna be real with y'all, man. I was just about to do a reaction video, but I had I had to make this. I had to make this because somebody needs to explain this to me. First off, I just want to say congratulations, Gino. Congratulations. My man's made the top 100 players. Now, I'm, I'm wearing a Marshawn Lynch jersey. Um, that Russell Wilson jersey, I threw it away. It's gone. Never will be seen again. I'm going to be real. Russell Wilson, he did, you know, he, he served his purpose. But, um, yeah. My man, Gino, congratulations. He's on the, he's the 77th player. DK Metcalf didn't make it. I don't know why not. Tyler Lockett. Didn't make it. One of the most underrated wide receivers in the league, but you know how they are with Tyler Lockett, bro. They hate they they hate us, bro. They hate us. But that's not what I wanted to discuss, bro. This is really what I wanted to talk about. And I'm gonna be real with y'all. Madden, this is ridiculous. First off, bro, let me explain this to y'all. Let me explain this to y'all. There's somebody missing off this top ten list. There's somebody missing. Pat Mahomes, Joe Burrow, Josh Allen, I'm not, I'm, they, they top three. Jalen Hurts, I'm not mad at that. This is what I'm mad at. Now, like Sol Luminati says, let me scan for a second. I need somebody to explain to me how Geno Smith is an 81 overall. First off, Jared Goff is trash. Let's get that out the way. Let's get that out the way. There are three quarterbacks that Geno Smith is undeniably better than on this list. One, Ryan Tannehill. That dude is garbage. He's horrible. That dude is... He ain't been good since... I don't know when. I I, I don't know when, bro. I, I'm not even sure Titan fans really are excited to have Ryan Tannehill. They picked up that um that that that, that quarterback that... um. The only thing I know about the quarterback that they picked up was that he they, that he apparently puts bananas in his coffee, or something like that. I don't know. I I think it. I don't know. It may be lies. It may be lies. I don't know. I have no idea. It may be straight up lies. But look at this man. So number one, Ryan Tenney was better than him. Number two, Justin Fields. That dude is garbage. The Bears aren't happy with his progress. Three. I don't care what y'all tell me. Kyler Murray and Derek Carr. I know I said three, but that's four. He's better than them. Now, let me just give y'all just a little bit. Let me let me just say this for quick. Click the wrong thing. Let me say this. There is no... There's, but listen, they don't like Seattle. It's already proven. They don't put us, they don't put us on TV like that. We literally just saw the schedule. I think we got a, a bye week in week week um week five, I think. Or week four? Like, yo, that's not normal. Everybody else gets bye weeks later on. I'm telling y'all, man. They don't like us. They don't like Seattle. I've already said this numerous times. Seattle, we're going to the Super Bowl. We're going to be a top three team in the NFC. I already know we will, man. We got we had the second best draft this year. We got the best corner and the best wide receiver. It's just game ball. We, we're going we're gonna to turn up, man. We're just going to turn up. But let me explain this to y'all. Let me go into detail. So, let's just, first off, let's, let's go in. Let's go in detail. First off, Jared Goff, we ain't going to look at his numbers. Let's look at it one by one. Geno's an 81. Trevor Lawrence. Geno Smith. These are his stats. 4,282 yards. Trevor Lawrence, 4,113. So Gino got more yards. Okay, let's go to touchdowns. 30 touchdowns, 25. Less interceptions, though, okay. But let's go with QBR. So, hey, let, let's just say Madden's going off QBR. Trevor Lawrence got a 54.5 QBR. My man's got a 60.8. So, yeah, let's get out the way. Trevor Lawrence, yeah, you're done. Let's close that path. Oh, my goodness, what's next? Yeah, so Geno should have been hired. Tua! Not Bo. Now, yes, Tua has been through a lot. He's got a higher QBR. But if y'all are telling me we're not going off QBR, my man Geno have more yards and more touchdowns than Tua. So what, what are we talking about? 
Are we going off QBR or are we going off of yards? I'm telling y'all, man, they, they don't respect us. Yeah, let's get two out of there, bro. We bet. Oh, my Lord. Bro, no, no, no. This is ridiculous with Aaron Rodgers. The glazing has to stop. There's two people on this list that they gotta get the that they gotta get the sausage out their mouths. Lamar Jackson and my and Aaron Rodgers. First off, Lamar Jackson should not be in 91. He should not be in 91. Jalen Hurts should be higher than Lamar Jackson. Jalen Hurts played better than Lamar did last year. And what Lamar didn't even play a full season. He was hurt. I don't understand why we're benefiting Lamar. But what? Bro, Justin Herbert should be higher than Lamar Jackson. I'm telling y'all, man, they're glazing. The glazing is on Hall of Fame. Look at Aaron Rodgers' stats and look at my stats. First off, yeah, yeah. Look at Jalen Hurts' stats and then look at Aaron Rodgers' stats. Look at the QBR. It's not even comparison. Then when we go to Geno versus Aaron Rodgers, oh, Geno got more yards. Oh, he got more touchdowns. And he got a higher QBR. Yeah, he got a higher QBR, and he got a, oh, it, that's crazy, bro, he has a higher QBR and higher yards, I'm telling y'all, man, they do not respect Geno, so yeah, where's Aaron Rodgers, get him out of there, Kirk Cousins, bro, I ain't gonna lie, Kirk Cousins is trash, and this is the only, Kirk Cousins is garbage, I don't care what the record said. I don't care what the record shows. 13 and 4, you didn't go far in the playoffs. The dude is trash. I've seen numerous games where Kirk Cousins could not get it done. And again, QBR. Geno Smith was the seventh in the NFL. Kirk Cousins 23rd. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah. Pack him up. Get him out of there. We 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 don't we don't care about Kirk Cousins no more. Who else is above him? Lamar Jackson. But let me go to Dak Prescott first. I'm from Texas, but I'm going to be real, bro. The glazing that they do Dak Prescott is ridiculous. I think the only reason that Dak is listed this high is because of is because of the scrutiny that he's, he's faced. I think that's the only reason. Because there's no way that you're going to sit there and tell me that Dak Prescott had a better season than Geno Smith. There's no way. So, Madden, what are we doing? That, that, there's no way. Look at this. 2,000 yards? My man's had 4,000. 23 touchdowns. My man's had 330. QBR, 57.9. My man's had 60.8. What are we doing? Any have more interceptions. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even look at that. Any have more interceptions. Yo. What are we doing, man? And then the final two, we got Jalen Hurts. I'm not even mad that Jalen Hurts is higher than Geno. He should be top four, five. Easily, bro. He should be number, really, should be number two. There's no reason Lamar should be high, man. Do need it. You ask me, I think Lamar should go all the way down to seventh. All the way down to seventh. That's just me personally. If I had to take one person off this top ten list, to be honest, have to be Kirk Cousins. The dude is trash. I've said this numerous times. Lamar Jackson. The glazing is disgusting. The glazing is disgusting. Outside of QBR, Mans did not have more touchdowns. And again, he did get injured, but still, 2,000 yards. Probably because he's doing all that running. Y'all know Lamar Jackson. Y'all know what he be doing. And that one year, Russell Wilson should have won MVP over him, too. They gave him that one. They gave him that one, absolutely. They gave him that one. They, they didn't. They don't like Seattle. I'm already, it, it's already proven. They don't respect Seattle. Look at this again. 2,000 yards. <sighs> Come on, man. Come on, man. And, and, and here's the thing. Let's just say, okay, let's say hypothetically they're like, okay, look, it's based off team success. That, bro, oh, if, if we're basing it off of team success, why is Aaron Rodgers higher than Geno? His team didn't have any success. They couldn't even beat the Boo Boo Lions and Lions fans. No disrespect when I say this. Y'all don't really no, y'all really don't got much to look forward to. Y'all aren't gonna make the playoffs. Y'all aren't gonna make it to the wild card. Y'all y'all gonna be trash for the next 10 years. 
I appreciate y'all for winning the game for us last season. Y'all get my respect on that, but come on, man. We went 9-8. and eight. Same as Tua. The same as Tua. And yet they gave Tua a higher one. Trevor Lawrence. Ain't that something, man? They just they they give him whatever he want. They give they whatever they desire. Same record. Same record. Where's Daniel Jones? Oh my goodness, Daniel Jones isn't even top twenty. Oh yeah, that's how you know you sorry. They named twenty quarterbacks better than you. It's all right though, Daniel. Absolutely ridiculous, man. Absolutely robbery. The Seattle Seahawks, we get disrespected. We're getting robbed. Preseason starts next month. We're finna go crazy. And I feel it. I feel like we're going to go crazy. I feel like this is our year. This is the opportunity for a lifetime. Bro, we're going to come out swinging because they disrespected Geno. First off, why is Jared Goff at 80 and my man's at 81? That's, that, that's basically saying that they're, they're next to each other. There's a huge gap between Geno and Jared Goff. Jared Goff is trash. If Jared Goff does not have a good system, he's garbage. He's garbage. He's garbage. Mark my words, though. Mark my words. We're going to be out of the league. We're going to be top five in the league. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. We're going to have top five ring defense. Our offense is already going to be good. Gino's gonna come back, bro. We're gonna start the season four, maybe five and zero. Oh. It's gonna be sweet, man. It's gonna be sweet. I can't wait to watch it. And I cannot wait to watch it. Oh, I cannot wait to see it. Cannot wait to see it. Look at this, bro. This is the schedule that we got. But this is sweet. This is sweet. This is sweet. The, 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 the Rams? We're going to smoke them up. Detroit, easy. Carolina, easy. Look at this, easy. These are just easy games. Easy games, man. But that's going to do for this video, man. I just had to. I had to discuss it. Had to rant about it. There's no reason. There's no way that Geno should be lower then Lamar. Lamar didn't even play the full season. Lamar didn't even play. Like, whoa. Like, look at the yards. Look at the yards. And even if, okay, Lamar is higher than my man Gino, why is he higher than Jalen Hurts? Jalen Hurts was top three quarterback last year. I tell y'all, man, the glazing is real. They glazed the Cowboys. They glazed, J they glazed Lamar. Pretty soon, they're going to start glazing Kirk Cousins. And Kirk Cousins been garbage for years, man. We just, y'all just don't know it. But that's going to wrap it up. Every Seattle fan out there, we here, man. We coming. And I'm going to be real. If you a, if you a Pat Mahomes fan, y'all are real lucky we don't play all this season. Y'all lucky we don't play all this season. Looking at the schedule now, y'all lucky we don't play all because we would have smoked y'all. Is what it is, man. Seattle Seahawks, the 2023 Super Bowl champs. We here.